was going to do these four exercises. We are back and Fabrizio della Rovere. I got that right now. I've been rehearsing. He kept talking about Madalena. So we are very happy to be able to meet the Madalena because Fabrizio spoke of you so much. Now the star of Unspoken Truth, which is a film that we're hearing so much about. And aren't you surprised at the popularity here in America? Did you have any idea expect that at all? No, not at all because do you know, <clears throat> it's actually the first movie for me that came out in America like that. Because, well, I had some, you know, success in um, Italy, and they know me in Italy when I walk in the street. But here in America, it's so huge, everything compared to over there, and I had no idea that it would really be that successful. No. Do movies <coughs> t have a bigger impact here in America, you think, than in Italy? They don't get so crazy like we do about movie stars? It's um, not such a big deal in Italy, so much attention? They do, but you know, there's much less movies that are being made in Italy, you know, there's maybe... And then, like, one out of hundred would become big and people would recognize the actors or know about the movie, you know? It's not that all those big movies come in the theaters over there, it's not like that at all. How was Unspoken <coughs> Truth in Italy, was it? Uh, it well, it was probably even more than here. I don't know because I just after shooting it and after it came out I had to go to America so I don't know. I just ah, heard what people told me. Until you get home but you won't know. I won't I don't really know exactly. I just heard yeah it was huge, you know, and people you know went crazy and we got nominated and they couldn't believe it, you know, because it's not very often that, you know, a foreign oh, movie sure. here gets nominated here in America. Except that lately it, it you know it it, um, it happened but usually no. So you're gonna, when you get off the plane, when you get back in Italy, you'll be surprised. Woo! Yeah. You, you won't be able to walk around the streets anymore. Probably not. I would have to start wearing those glasses too to be cool, like <laughs> here, everyone in LA, you know. Oh, you learned that already, <laughs> I huh? Guess I did. So, do you have your glasses that you wear into the Academy yeah, Awards? I got them right with me. Yeah. Sure. Well, you have to do what everyone does here, you know. Otherwise, they look at you like you're from some other planet. I think. Are you surprised at how po popular, you know, you go to Sunset Boulevard and you sit at the cafes and have your, your mochaccino or your cappuccino? Are you surprised? <laughs> well, I have the cappuccino. Um, <clears throat> it seems, except the people, it's look, it's like a little bit like in Europe, actually. You know, you have the same thing and then people start coming to me and, you know, they would ask me and they would congratulate me to the movie and stuff. And sometimes now it's unusual for me because, you know, I like my privacy, um, privacy and now they come up to me and they recognize me from all.